Just, I knew that you had two ex-wives named Tammy, so I was hoping that there was one that you got along with, and... No, I hate them both. On my deathbed, my final wish is to have my ex-wives rush to my side so I can use my dying breath to tell them both to go to hell one last time. Would I get married again? Oh, absolutely. If you don't believe in love, what's the point of living? Tammy's just a woman, a nice woman. You know, she's not a murderer. She's not a dragon. It's really good to see you, Ron. You've aged horribly. You son of a bitch. That didn't take Oh long. my God! Not what is your idea. problem? Nothing's changed, has it? Changed. Who set the bed on fire, Excuse huh? me. I did, okay? Is that what you want to oh, eat? Oh, we're fine, okay, we're fine. I'm so Please, sorry. Fine. Oh take my it God. easy. When you meddle in someone's personal life, it's just so rewarding. about Ron. You're just using him to get Law 48 for your library. Leslie, that's crazy. And correct. Why are you doing this? Les, there are two kinds of women in this world. There are women who work hard and stress out about doing the right thing, and then there are women who are cool. Okay. Hello, Tammy. Oh, hello, Ron. I didn't see you come in. I was just checking myself for scoliosis. And? Straight as an arrow. Just like somebody else I know. Jerky? Call off the dogs. You and I both know that in my entire adult life, I have never checked a book out of the library. Oh my god, she's amazing. <laughs> Tom, what the hell are you doing? Same thing you're doing, celebrating Pawnee's finest. I believe you know my date, Tammy Swanson. Hi, Ron. Oh, hi, Ron. Hey, Ron. I'm sorry, is seeing your ex-wife on my arm making you uncomfortable? Gee, I can't imagine why. Or can I? Ooh, I like this song. Do you want to dance, Tammy? Oh, yeah, yeah. Oh. Oh. I know Tammy seems scary, but really she's just a manipulative, psychotic, library book peddling, sex crazed she demon. It's time for Tammy and me to bury the hatchet once and for all. Everything will be fine. <laughs> It's been like this for hours. Hey, Swanson! Snap out of it! Leslie! Congratulate us. Okay. Ron's got one just like it on his penis. Oh, yeah. What the hell happened to you? Well... You may now kiss the bride. Mm. 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 It's been kind of a crazy night. Come back. Come back. Uh, it's not real, man. She's just messing with you. He's lying, Ron. Stay out of this gland. It's Tom. And I'm not lying. I'm not going to let you destroy Ron. You're just going to have to. Ow! 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 Do better than that. Yeah. Oh, oh. Why are you hitting yourself, uh, Lance? Uh, Stop uh, hitting yourself. Tammy, <laughs> that's enough. Hey, baby. You almost had me. Again. But seeing you pick on this pathetic, defenseless little man hey. reminded me what kind of a monster you are. You're a joke. You're not even a man anymore. Oh, and by the way, last night, I faked four out of the seven. <laughs> so did I. Let's go, son. Red alert, Swanson. Your ex-wife is back. 
No kidding, Donna. Not her. The other ex-wife. Tammy won. She's in your office. Hello, Tammy. Ronald. That's enough small talk. What do you want? You remember what I do for a living, I trust. Yes, you ruin people's lives. You're being audited, Ronald. I don't care. And why is your mustache trembling? I'm here as a friend. Call it nostalgia. Or perhaps guilt for all the times I tried to smother you in your sleep. I don't need your help. Wrong. You do. What is you're so fond of saying it's a free country? Good luck. I hope you don't go to jail. Sit up straight. You're not doing your breasts any favors. Thank you. Hi. Your breasts look amazing. Is this true? You only spent $40 on clothes in the past five years? Sounds about right. How did you meet Tammy One? Technically, I've known her since I was born. She was a candy striper at the hospital. She helped deliver me. Oh, oh my, my God. God. I grew up in a very small town, 600 people. Everybody knew everybody else. We first took up together when I was 15. Awesome. Oh my God. It was a little scandalous, but everyone feared her, so they kept their mouths shut. Tammy, may I use the restroom? Remember to wash your hands. OK, you know what? Let's cut the crap. Is this audit even real? In a sense, yes. But in another truer sense, no, it is not. I want Ronald back, but I had to learn about his finances to make sure my future was protected. I'm impressed. He's acquired quite a bit of gold. You gold digger. You are literally a gold digger. The thing I love about Tammy is she calls me on my crap. Every guy needs that. It's time to settle this. Ah, an old-fashioned prairie drink-off. Oh, what's in that jug? It smells like jet fuel. That's Swanson family mash liquor, made from the finest corn ever grown on American soil. It's only legal use is to strip varnish off of speedboats. If you win, he's all yours. And if I win, I bring him back to the farm for good. Pour it. I'm thirsty. Pour me one, too, then. Let me in here. I'm going to join you. And if I win, Ron stays here with us. Leslie, no, don't drink that. We use it to burn warts off of the mules. I made a mistake. I made a mistake. This ends now. Yeah. Mom, you're going back to the farm. And you? You're going back to hell. Fine. I got what I came for anyway. I found your underground safe. I stole half your gold. That's decoy gold. You think I'd leave my gold in a locked safe buried underground where anyone could find it? You don't know me at all. Yes, I do. I knew you the minute you were born. I intend to be there the minute you die. Ron, your family's weird. This could end up being the best night in Ron Swanson's life. I am so, so happy for him. Hello, you gorgeous craftsman. Wow, look at this room. So much wood ready to be worked. <laughs> Me.